What's up guys, it's Chris here with Forbidden Food TV for your Friday food review for you. And what I've got for you guys today is a variety of Raw Revolution organic live food bars. So I've got a total of five to show you guys and try. So the first one we've got here is the Raw Revolution Spir Spirulina Dream. Spirulina Dream. By the way, all of these are all organic, first of all. Gluten-free, non-GMO, kosher, and vegan. If you can see, it's quite green in color. Not sure how well you guys can see that, but they look very similar to the, um, the Lara bars I've had before. So let's give it a shot. The Spirulina Dream Bar. <laughs> Very tasty. So what does this have in it here? We've got cashews as the front of the packaging would suggest. Here's cashews, dates, organic sunflower seed kernels, agave nectar, almonds, spirulina powder, sprouted flax seed. That's tasty. I'm for any of you that wanted seven grams of protein in, in this one here. Next up, we've got the chocolate coconut bliss. Yes, sir. All right, so the chocolate coconut bliss. The rest of them, I'm pretty certain, all contain chocolate. For all you chocolate lovers out there. This one here, obviously dark brown in color because it is chocolate, obviously. First of all, it looks like seven grams of protein is the effect through all of these bars, first of all. This one, we've got cashews, organic sunflower seed kernels again, the agave nectar, organic dates, organic coconut, organic cocoa, processed with alkali, organic almonds, organic sprouted flaxseed. So the flaxseed, the dates, those all seem to be a predominant factor in these. A big old almond in there. Honestly, it tastes like a really healthy version of a, um, like a Mounds or like an Almond Joy. Chocolate lovers and coconut lovers. You'd be all, all over this for sure. Okay, next up we've got the Almond Buttercup. So in this one there is almonds, dates, sunflower seed kernels again, agave nectar, chocolate chunks, cane sugar, Chocolate liqueur, cocoa butter, soy, leche thin, uh, vanilla extract, sprouted flaxseed, sea salt. Okay, so this one a little bit, a little lighter in color on this here, this here sa, almond buttercup. A little softer than the others. Pretty rich, along with the chocolate chunks in that. It's rich, but it's pretty balanced out. But not quite as super, and it's actually buttery is a good way to describe. So next we've got the chocolate peanut butter. Chocolate peanut butter? Chunky peanut butter chocolate. Again, the peanuts, agave nectar, chocolate chunks, cane sugar, chocolate liqueur, cocoa butter, soy leche thin, uh, vanilla extract, chia seeds, sprouted flaxseed sea salt. Six grams of protein with this one, four grams of fiber. Again, gluten-free, non-GMO. Ooh, wow. That, does smell, that smells like, can you smell that? Can you smell that right there? That's like peanut butter heaven is what that smells like right, right there. Okay, so let's give this one a shot. Huh. If you can see this, there's a giant like dab of peanut butter right in the middle of that. <laughs> well, you know we gotta get some of that action. Oh, bigger bite.
for you peanut butter lovers, the chunky peanut butter chocolate is... I'll get this one again. I'll, I'd get them all again so far. But that one's, if you're in a peanut butter mood, get that one. And here's our last one we've got for you, which is the cherry chocolate chunk. Almonds and dates seem to be the going trend. The sunflower kernels as well, agave nectar, chocolate chunks, all that stuff I've listed plenty of times. Cherries, shrouded flax seeds, sea salt, cherry flavor. Why did I think this had chocolate in it? I guess it's because it's got chocolate cup. <laughs> Because it's got chocolate covered cherries on the front, I guess. Let's give this one a shot. I don't know. They're all pretty, they're all pretty good. If you're looking for something with a little more fruit sweetness and whatnot, I definitely say go ahead and try the, the chocolate, the cherry chunk one there. That one had a little more fruit bite to it. Um, just to go over them, you know, I don't even feel like I need to go over them all. Like, Raw Revolution's bars are really, they're really good. If I had to pick a favorite, the peanut butter was probably this guy. That was actually the almond buttercup one. As soon as I bit into it, I'm like, wait, this isn't the right one. The chunky peanut butter chocolate, that, that gets... If you're a peanut butter lover, get that. If you're into a little more fruit, try the cherry. If you want something maybe more nut oriented with the spirulina and whatnot, try the spirulina. They were all great. The almond butter cup one was great. The coconut one was great. That tastes like a Mounds bar to me. They were all delicious. So I feel like all five of them deserve like a five, they're all delicious. They've got between like five and seven grams of protein a piece. They've got some fiber in there. They're delicious guys, I definitely recommend them. Uh, all of them. The peanut butter was was like, right up there is my favorite, but I have no least favorite, honestly. They're all, they're all equally impressive as they are. So I hope you enjoyed the review today of these five Raw Revolution bars. As always, it's been Chris with Forbidden Food TV. As always, like, share, subscribe, and favorite to Forbidden Food TV on all those social platforms, yourself and myself, know and love, on YouTube, on Facebook, on Twitter, on Instagram.com forward slash Forbidden Food TV. I will see you guys on Tuesday. Peace.